when you look at the Sphinx, you're dealing with thousands of years of water erosion. Yes. And the last time there was water like that in the Nile Valley was when? It was during the Younger Dryas. It was a period of extremely heavy rains in Africa. It's erosion caused by heavy rains that is the enigma on the Great Sphinx. It's not. We're not saying that there was a flood came over the Great Sphinx. We're looking at what's called precipitation-induced weathering. Weathering that was caused by exposure to about a thousand years of extremely heavy rainfall. Precisely in the Younger Dryas period. That's the last time that rains of that magnitude fell on Egypt, and it's why we cannot sensibly accept the insistence of Egyptologists that the Sphinx is just four and a half thousand years old. Yes, 2,500 BC, the ancient Egyptians were there, but they found the Sphinx already created and already heavily eroded.